All right, gang, I know it's been a while since my last video. I'm sorry. And since my last video, you guys can see that things have gotten really hairy. I promise you it doesn't look like this now, but just wanted to show you what I was dealing with. And to combat that, I got six Troca snails and I got six more. And so before we get into how the tank looks currently, um, I want to show you guys a little bit of the bad news <laughs> and the good news. <laughs> so for the bad news, I cannot take care of Acropora. I've tried, there's a couple pieces that went through STN. I fragged them up hoping they would survive, but they didn't. Some good news, I got a new light set up. And also this. All right, enough messing around. So here we are, guys. I'm gonna show you what the rock is cooking. And if you can see all the bubble algae on my rock in between my coral. And right here in the middle, it's just completely taken over. I did get an emerald crab and he started up top here between my monoporas. So slowly but surely, hopefully he uh, does some damage, but no rush. All right, so I turned on the lights to show you the bubble algae, but now that I got them off, I can show you what I got going here. I got my Acan very far left. He's struggling. Uh, my two Dragon Soul Favias front and back. My Acans up front. That's a Hollywood Stunner in the back. That's another Favia in the back as well, growing like crazy. Um, I don't know what this guy is. I think that's uh, another Favia. Love the color on him, but I don't know what it's called. This guy as well, Favia, I believe. Love my Forest Fire Digitata. My Monopora, I got this guy at the same time as this guy, at the same time as this guy. And this guy is slacking. Uh, some Euphilia down here. Frog Spawn, my Scalemia, love this guy. My little Zoa, or my wannabe Zoa garden. Um, another Monopora. And then I got an Acropora in here, Green Slimer. His polyps are getting longer, but the coloration is not quite there yet. Here's a Monopora that's just going crazy. I did break him off while one of the water changes and I got a few back there. Hopefully doing okay. And then I just love my Euphilias here, which are getting huge. This is a blue hammer. And then I got a neon green hammer. And this one's kind of uh, aqua green. And then if I can just use the reflection, I got another blue hammer back there. And a piece of Cyphastria that broke off is just starting to grow on the rock. It's pretty awesome. Well, that's about it for this one, guys. Thanks for sticking around. Um, I'm gonna close it out with some clips and pictures for you guys to enjoy my tank. And hopefully in another four months when my next video comes out, all the bubble algae will be gone, but you guys won't be. Um, and please be patient with me. I'm not gonna rush my tank and I don't like to stress out with the videos making them all the time because it is a little stressful. And I also wanted to give you guys just a little sneak peek of what I got coming next. Stick around. Love you guys. Why is it so brown?
How's the filtration in this? 